Hey there, welcome to the locker room. Coach Arias here. Today's message is transform or conform. Transform into a better you and a better us or conform to the people around us. Let's not conform. Let's talk about conforming for a little bit. Conforming is doing what other people think is cool and not being a one percenter, not being a three percenter that does something better or bigger or gets bigger or better things, but you conform to what other people think is cool, to what other people do in business. You want to be great in business, but you conform to what other people think is hard work or what other people think is, is enough, and you don't push beyond those limits because you have conformed. Or in school, you don't study as much because you got to be, and you've conformed to thinking that that's good enough. Or in sports, with your workout, you, 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 everybody works out one to three most of the team, so you conform to that, what everybody else around you is doing instead of going the extra mile. You want to do something extra, you want to be extraordinary. The difference between ordinary and extraordinary is just that one word, extra. We can't conform. Don't conform to other people's negative outlook and other people's negative attitude. We got to transform. Transforming, being a transformer is being a leader, walking alone. Others will follow you down the road, but leaders sometimes walk alone at first because they don't conform. You have to grow yourself in order to transform. We have to worry about being a better us tomorrow than we were today, which, which means that we have to invest into ourselves. In order to transform, I think we should hang around those that you want to be like. Let's not get advice from people that we wouldn't want to trade places with. If you want to transform, we need to be around people that we can transform, like, or emulate. Be the best version of us that we can be. I'm not saying be anybody else, but it helps to be around the right influences. And the reason why I got the Inspiring Minds t-shirt on today is in my hometown. Dream was always to come back and help Youngstown, Ohio. We're starting a youth program of Inspiring Minds. is starting a branch in Youngstown, Ohio. And, you know, I've had the blessing of working with one of the most humble, successful men in Jim Trestle that I've ever seen in my life. Thank you for giving me somebody to look up to in, in levels of success he's had. He's been willing to jump on board with us and help us transform a community and make kids' lives better, along with Bo Pelini, the new coach at Youngstown State, former Nebraska coach, always Youngstown born and bred, and Boom Boom Mancini, the pride of Youngstown, former uh, world boxing champion, is also going to be there in attendance helping us out. But the message is, the reason why I bring those people and these things up is they're not conforming to society. They're not conforming to saying they're too busy to help out their city. The kids are not going to conform to what they perceive and everybody in the city thinks is cool with, with just loud music or doing this certain way or acting a certain way. We're going to transform these kids' lives so we can transform a community, so we can transform generations of people's lives in that area. And in order to do that, it takes a leader to step up, step out, and show out. So guys, I want to encourage us all today, don't conform, let's transform, and when we do that, we'll be on our way to living our very best life. Thanks for joining us this week in the locker room, looking forward to seeing you guys all next week or at the gala.